This is how your essay should look when it comes into me. The essay should be in MLA format. Your name, first and last name, my name, whatever your section number is, English 112, DO1, DO3, DO4, and the date that it comes in, a title that is centered. It is not in a larger type font. It is not italicized. It's unadorned, just a straightforward sentence, or rather just a straightforward title. Only put this in a header so that it appears on every page, your last name, page one, two, three, so forth. The heading does not appear on every page. If you would like more details about this, look at the video under web links and you will find out how to set up your paper using MLA format. Make sure that the entire essay is double spaced automatically. Do not hit the enter key twice. That is going to throw off the spacing. Make sure that all paragraphs are indented. Underline your claim. This is the writer's claim and I will post this essay separately so you can look at it in more detail. You're not going to be able to read it as I scroll through this. Underline your claim because that's going to tell me that you know what your paper is about and your point of view. Underline your topic sentences because that establishes the focus of each paragraph. Also underline your transitions. For example, however, nevertheless, moreover, for example, she's underlined her transition here. Additionally, underline the topic sentence. Furthermore, that's a transition. Regardless, topic sentence. I'm having you underline those so that I know that you know what they are. And there is a long list in course documents. And I also encourage you to look at best practices. Here, consequently, those are transitions. All in all, that's a transition. And also make sure that you have a concession refutation, meaning that you have a counter argument. You only have to have one paragraph. It's also called a concession. You look at link nine under the web links and it will explain it in more detail. You simply acknowledge that other people feel differently. Regardless, nurse managers make the final decisions on the budget and spending allocations for their departments. Either they recognize the value of quality nursing assistance to, the, to their clinical team and spend ample time interviewing and hiring new members, or the unit will suffer from stressed employees and unsatisfied patients. Then her conclusion, and everybody should have, every essay should have a self-evaluation. That is exactly how your paper should look. MLA format, everything double-spaced, paragraphs indented, underline your claim, underline your topic sentences, underline your transitions, make sure you have a counter-argument paragraph, make sure you have a conclusion, and make sure you have a self-evaluation. Good luck!